Hi, today I want to show you a quick tip in Caden Live. I'm using the version 2304.1. Let's start with the title clip. So, assuming I'm going to do something like step 2. And put it here. Now I got a video clip prepared. So let's zoom in. Now assuming I want to cross fading to the video clip here. In this case I, I want to start talking when the uh, transition completed. Unfortunately the starting silent part is not long enough to cover the whole transition. So for example, if I run here, then you will see the image just jump in. So what you can do is, uh, you can get a screenshot of this image and put it here. Or the other way is you can cut it from here and slow down this part, change the speed to make it longer. So for example, maybe slower, but unfortunately, uh, Caden Live is trying to extend the end of the clip. So I have to go to out and move the clip to here. And now change the speed. For example, slow down, then say OK. Then it will fill here. But this is not the way I usually do. So let's undo that. So let's assuming I cut this. What I always do is use the control button and hold the button and drag it. You can see the speed is changing accordingly. Now I've got the full clip uh, covering the transition. So there's no jump in image. Let's run it. Then you will see the speech will start after the transition. There are more things you Okay, that's all about what I want to show you today. Uh, it's a very short video. I hope you find this video useful. If you like it, please give me a thumb up. Thank you for watching. Bye.